Well, good morning, everybody. Yep, I'm back at the lake. It's starting to go down. It's down pretty good right now. Uh, what, 20 foot maybe or so? I uh, thought I'd come out here to this spot I've hit before. Been over to the other side and found a few, found a nice carabiner up on the, near the bank and a little charm. Been going through here and I'm trying out the new dais. Uh, I don't have the, I've got it hooked up on my arm and in my headphones up my sleeve and up in my little, I've got little, you know, little earbuds in and um, they're working pretty good until I get me some wireless my uh, headphones. But I've got it in basic. I've been going between basic and um, uh, GM power, uh, and I've it's been great on this lake. Uh, I, I tried day as fast, but it's it's a little too fast. It's a little too much noisy, too much too much noise. So I went back to basic uh, and got over here and got a perfect nickel si uh, nickel uh, 66 perfect signal. Pop this up. Now I don't know what it is. It may be junk. You know, that little rusty looking right there, I don't know, it might be tungsten or something, I'm not sure, but now that has got the perfect signal for gold. Let's see, it. yeah, it's a stainless, or titanium, I see it now. I thought it looked a little bit too much like titanium. And that's what it is, let me get my focus in here. There we go. It's titanium, but it's a ring. My first ring with the desk. Really the first time I've really been out. I've messed around a little bit the other day, uh, but this is the first serious hunt I wanted to get on this lake bed. And this thing is really, this lake is really rough. I had my V3 and uh, I couldn't use it in three frequencies. It just tore this, it tore the V3 up, but this one's doing good. So, all right, we'll get back with you if you get anything else. Well, I'm still at the lake. I dug a signal, it sounded like an old piece of crap. And looky there, let me get it in here in the line. It's one of them pro cams, one of them, Sport cam. That's pretty cool. First one of those I found. I'll not get the sand out of it too bad and get it scratched up, but I'll uh, I'll take it back home, get in that thing, see if there's anything in it. That's pretty cool. First one of those I found. I found five GoPros this year, but that's the first one of those I found. Alright, let's get back to it. Well, keep going around through here. Just past the cam was right over there. I got a signal in the 40s and 50s, and uh, I don't know if I can see. I can't see nothing with this bright sun. Right there it is. You can, there we go. Let's see if we can focus in on it. Looks like a ring, I can't tell. Yeah, it's a ring. Yeah, ain't it? Yeah, it's a ring. All right. I don't know if it's anything. Oh, it's a class ring. <laughs> All right. Class ring. It may be a cheap one. But it's a class ring. Make sure that's focused. I can't see nothing in this old bright sun. There we go. It's a little better. Hold on. I'm trying to get it focused. Make sure it's focused thing on you. There we go. Maybe that's focused. I can't see a thing on these old phones. All right. Let me get that cleaned up and I'll get back with you. Hope you can see that. It says Continental Academy. I ain't got a clue where that's at. It ain't over around here. 2005 it's not gold it's that uh, cheap stuff i had to buy when i was in school so all right well we'll try to get back in touch with the person it's got a name inside of it i'll see what i can do all right we'll get back all right, with here's the wrap up the usual stuff clad little knobs find those all the time over there at that lake uh, a lot of lead sinkers uh, there's a whole bag of lead sinkers somebody dropped lighters i'm really not sure what those are there's a nice carabiner um a strap necklace junk but these little care these little strap or the little washer like things i don't know they got three or uh, teeth on the inside of them but they're rubbery hard rubber i don't know what those are they were found within a few feet of each other so i'm not really what they are here is some bling believe hopefully you can, that's focused believe and then here's something really cool this let me get a close-up of that 
it is a military button of some sort. Well, I'll get it situated here in just a second. Here we go. Like one of the wars. I know they have those different stripes, different colors for different wars. I'm not sure what that is, but if you guys know, let me know. But it's definitely a military pin because the back of it's really nice. I mean, it was. It's not just a regular old cheap old chunk. Okay, and then as far as the rings go that I found, there's the class ring. If anybody can help me, I cannot find the owner of this or find any information on this. It says Continental Academy. And then that has like an Indian dream catcher with Vey, V-E-Y. And I thought it was 2005, but it's 2009. So... If you guys have any clue and can help me with that, I've come into a dead end. Call the school. It's more of a uh, like a GED online deal. They were not helpful at all. Uh, the ring company couldn't help me either. And so, and here's the titanium, uh, just a typical titanium. And a camera. I found a camera. And I got it back to the guy just before I even had time to do the wrap up later on. Um, I got up with him on Facebook, had some friends help me, and uh, got it back to him. So, anyway, that's the, the wrap up. Pretty good day. So, oh, this is kind of cool. This is a foul. This is what Speedo is going to put their next bikini or their next uh, men's bathing suit in. I thought that was pretty cute. All right, guys. We'll see you.